Hello, friends, and welcome. You are watching episode number five of our Software Incorporated Alpha 9 Banstra PC Let's Play. My name is Sean, and I'm glad that you are here with me today as we play some video games. When we left off, we had just released our flat draw PC software, or whatever it is, the 2D editor software. Uh, we did a couple of um, couple of uh, of uh, contract things at the end of the last month. Got some going on this month as well. Get those released, make us a little extra money. We're gonna do some support for flat draw here over the next uh, couple of months, and then we'll start up our next project, probably a, a music uh, a music editor or something like that. Easy easy one to work on. And um, yeah, yeah. So there we go. Uh, I guess the B team is on vacation or something this month. I don't know where they all went to. Oh, and I, I guess another thing I need to do is assign this room. That's Team B. Uh, you should be Team C over here. There we go. And this is Team Marketing, right? Right. I guess I didn't really need to do that. I could do this. Okay, that's fine. Whoops, that does not undo that button. That undoes that button. Well, I'm feeling pretty good about uh, how things are going for our company. Uh, usually, the first uh, the first release is uh, can be a little little. Uh, you never know how it's going to work out. Oh, good sales! Sales are holding strong. We still have forty six thousand in stock, so probably not going to have to make any more. Sales probably are going to uh, one month overdue. Shit, I forgot all about that. That's too bad. We took a little penalty on that. Um, that's too bad. Ten thousand dollar penalty too. Well, that's why we shouldn't be doing contract stuff at this point. We're a successful company. We don't need to be working on contract anymore. It's frustrating. It'd be nice if there was um, like an uh, something like uh, your project is due today, or you know, like when it's a release date. This was your release month. Are you sure you don't want to release it by the end of the day? Just like a little warning at the end of the at midnight before it becomes the next day. Uh, it'd be real nice to have something like that. Uh, but we don't, so, you know, what are you going to do? Um, I don't think anybody is going to classes or anything, right? So hopefully you guys actually show up for work today. I don't know why you didn't show up last month. What time does Team B come into work? Team B shows up at noon. All right, must be nice sleeping in like that. Well, if you've watched uh, if you've watched any of the other videos that I made today, um, you know that they're doing some construction outside my window. So if you hear beeping or you hear me scream like "Oh my God, it's an earthquake!" Uh, it's probably just them pounding on the ground outside my window. But boy, they are they are really going to town out there. Uh, it's so weird, like, to feel my, uh, to, like, feel the ground shaking. Uh, yep, I didn't think anybody would be able to reach you. Still can't reach it? Really? I just want the fan in the center of the room. It looks so weird when it's off-center like that. But I guess that's, that's how it's gonna be, huh? Kinda hard to get nice, uh, I'm trying to get a nice, uh, screen. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, for the cover of this episode. Um, kind of hard to do with those, that fan there. I guess I could turn off, turn off those things. Turn off the overlay as well. That's not too bad. Prefer to be able to see, but then we've got all those cube, cube walls in the way. Hmm. Cool. Exciting, exciting, um, uh, commentary there, Sean. All right, uh, so we've got a lot of bugs to work on, and uh, our team does not seem to quite be keeping up with it. Do I need to hire a couple more programmers to be able to squash all these bugs? Don't know. Let's see what kind of money we make this month. Uh, a little over $100,000, so at least we're still still profitable and everything, which is no problem. Um, but those bugs are definitely piling up. So I think I might want to expand our programmer team. Although, yeah, because I just want to train these guys up before I start. Like, I 
kind of want to get another designer in here to help with our next project. Um, I don't think we have any of our uh, any of our folks trained up in design yet. Uh, of course, Sean is, but um, Amber and Ben are not. So, uh, yeah. Well, how about I just hire one uh, additional programmer for now? We'll look at all those things. Although, considering I'm spending eight grand to to do the job search, might might help to hire two. Let's see if there's two that are great. So she's great, but her skills are not very strong. He's great. And his skills are much better. Look at that. Two of them are great, just like I thought. So we'll go ahead and hire both of those programmers. And uh, that means we're going to have to make desks for them. So we will copy that cube wall there and there. And then we will uh, go ahead and clear that desk out and clear that desk out. <coughs> Excuse me. And then we're going to copy that right there and there. There we go. That's not really what I wanted to do. And uh, right, so you're all set. So Team B has gotten nice, uh, nice room set up there. That definitely should help us uh, help us with our support here. And I think I'm actually going to go ahead and, and let Sean start working on our next product. So. We're going to go with an audio tool. That's usually a good follow-up to the 2D tool. Um, uh, let's go with uh, listener. And uh, oh wait, sorry. There we go. Listener, because it's it's cool, man. Uh, audio playback, music editor. Sure, sure. Why not? Uh, 2D editor. Well, there's only one choice, and that's our own. Go with the proprietary um, product there. And uh, we don't have a server, so I guess we're not going to have any server control management. Um, and we will uh, port this out to all of... Now, can we not do recording? Which has not been uh, unlocked yet. Depends on 8-bit audio from operating system. All right. I'm not quite sure what that means, but... Um, maybe if we connect it... Well, we want to connect it to the popular systems. So that's those two right there. We've already licensed those out, which is real nice. We don't have to pay... Uh, again for licensing fee uh, so I'd say that we're good more than a year that's okay take our time it's gonna take even longer with only one uh, one person on the uh, on the team there we're going to uh, unassign team a from that so Sean just focus on listener and uh, team B and C are going to focus on bugs and then you guys will focus on listener once the design process is over with this could take us a while to get the design down on this though and um, yeah, look at that. We're making reasonable progress with the bugs. Not great. I, I would like to uh, I'd like to have more fixed by now, but uh, I don't know. I mean, like, does it? Do we get customers complaining or anything? I'm still selling a few copies of Flat Draw. We've got four. Oh my gosh, we've got too many in stock, though. How many did I print up? I didn't print any extras or anything, did I? Did I print 70,000 at the start? What was I thinking? I think I would have printed like 50,000 or something. Let's uh, let's call for a cleaning cleaning person. Um, yeah, just one. That's all we really need. How's our IT looking? Yeah, you know, we really could use IT as well. Uh, I'll try to remember to do that at the end of the day. Why don't you guys remind me? Yell at your screen in like two minutes. And I'll, uh, I'll call for IT. Ah, much better. We should just get, like, that kind of gross-looking brown-colored carpets, and then we'd never even know if uh, if we weren't keeping them clean or not. You guys are really going in and out that door a lot, huh? Clickety-click. Ben would like a sink in the bathroom, but tough, Ben. Sorry, buddy. Not available. Is there a can you specify bathroom? Of course you can't. Common kitchen. Kitchen? 
No, nope, not even a sink for the kitchen. Common area. Do we do we have a uh, water cooler? We don't, do we? Well, let's get us a water cooler. People like to stand around and chit chat around the water cooler. There we go. That'll make people a little happier. Development's coming along just fine. Bug squashing, maybe not so fine. We're gonna pull these guys away from uh, working on bugs and put them on the listener. Might not be so great. You know what I might do is reassign one of the programmers, like the good programmer from over here, combine him up uh, with, uh, you know what I mean, with uh, Team C, and then have Sean and Team C work on listener while everybody else works on support. That might be the best idea. Put a uh, cube wall in there as well. Not really going to be able to get in and out of there very easily, though. All right, let these drones go home. Ah, you know, we're still halfway halfway through the bugs. Seems like no matter how many bugs you take care of. Hey, thanks for reminding me. Let's get that IT in here. Call IT support. I don't think we really need to call maintenance, do we? Ah, every time I do that. Um, 78%, 67%. You know what, let's go ahead and call maintenance. Why not? And that's one less thing for me to have to worry about. All right, speed it up. Get all those things running smooth. Very good. Thank you, everyone. Boy, we already need another cleaning crew in here, don't we? Uh oh, good sales yesterday on the uh, software. Surprising. Never know how it's gonna how it's gonna end up, but yeah, three hundred thousand dollars last month. Still have plenty on hand. Still putting in plenty of marketing. Do I have a do I have a cap on our marketing? I don't think we're hitting the cap anyways. I will uncap the marketing. Let's see, maybe it'll, maybe it'll keep selling. Sometimes software sells better like after six months than it did during the first few months. It really doesn't make sense, but sometimes that happens. Oh, I really want to get this promoted. We're almost there, everybody. Probably not until tomorrow though, really. Might be able to get a little work on it today. Look at that. Nice job, Sean. All right. So, listener, we're going to assign Team B to that as well. Well, oh, nope. Team C. Thank you. And um, over here on Team B, that must be Ben. Ben is our Team B leader. Sorry, Ben. You are going to uh, change over to Team C, and you're going to be an important role on Team C doing some programming. So, is that you right there, Ben? Well, it's too bad you're already going to this computer because I... There we go. Go to the other office. There we go. Great. Now let's work on listener. And that's going to take months and months. We'll check up on it on in like May. See how the progress is going. Maybe we can announce a release date by then. And I guess we're going to want to call... Excuse me, gosh. I guess we're going to want to call another cleaning crew in tonight. Everybody's going home, so let's get that cleaning crew in here. Bye, everybody. Thanks for all your hard work. See you next time. Skip ahead. 7 a.m. Time to make the donuts. Now, who left their computer on? Why wouldn't you shut it off? Wasting electricity. You should be disappointed in yourself. Nice calm day for Sean to be working in the office by himself. We do want three programmers on this, right? Yep, three of three, very good. Potential to reach a lot of customers. I don't think it's actually going to. 
but we should have decent sales with it. Help establish our reputation. Not sure what we'll do for our next piece of software. Can, can we develop antivirus yet? Antivirus software is, uh, with the old, uh, the old system, they were super popular. I don't know if that's changed. With the older alphas, they were super popular. But I don't see a uh, option for it anyways. We could always do a CMS or a, uh, office software. Is there any research that we could be doing? I've never really actually done any research yet. I know it's something you can do. Why don't we throw some of that money into our insurance policy? We've only got $300,000 in there. We'll deposit half a million dollars. We've got a couple of million dollars in the bank. I don't know whether I should be... Uh, I'd been withdrawing money from that previously. And I don't know if that makes people unhappy. Uh, or affects their uh, loyalty or anything like that. So I'm, I don't really want to mess with it. It's an insurance policy. I don't know if it should be used as a bank account. On the other hand, if we put all of our cash in hand, on hand in there, I mean, you know, you'd think people would be understanding. The uh, subreddit and stuff isn't very active for this, um, so it's not like I can uh, go there and, and really ask for, for details on it. I tried looking around for, uh, you know, when I first started uh, thinking about doing this series, I wanted to, you know, because I like to if it's a, an established game, I like to come in into these episodes kind of knowing what I'm doing. Even with brand new games, uh, I like to spend a couple of hours playing so I have a basic idea. And I'll, I'll read up or watch other people do Let's Plays or something so I don't come off like a total idiot. Um, and uh, so I wanted to, to get an idea of what a strategy for playing on hard difficulty would be. And like, there's nothing out there for hard difficulty on this game. And basically all of these quote unquote strategy that I read I love how I did air quotes with my fingers when I said that, like you guys can see it. Can you see? I've got a microwave. I don't know if you could see it through my microwave. But um, anyways, uh, um, all of the uh, quote strategy uh, was to set up a server farm and then just lease out space on your server. Uh, and then people are like, oh, uh, that's a good exploit. It's a good way to make a bunch of money. It's like, no, I don't want to make money through that. That sounds like a really boring game. <laughs> Uh, I'd rather make money through software and so forth. Um, so, uh, yeah, insurance. Don't know whether people get upset if you use your insurance as a, uh, a way to manage your funds. Uh, but I'm not going to worry about it. How's that sound? These guys, are they working at a low... No, they're working at a pretty high level of efficiency. 134%. 143. Wow, you're very efficient. 134 Okay, well, I don't need to worry about that. Now, did Ben uh, take the day off or something? Calling sick, maybe? We're going to do a review of Listener at the end of the day. Get our first, uh, first idea of what people think. Be able to estimate how our progress is going. Be nice if we could release it like in January. All right, uh, review, outsource. Spent a couple thousand dollars on that. Oh, that's way more money than I wanted to spend, but okay. Oh, it is not going so well. 80%, uh, we're, at, we're at two. Okay, so probably not gonna release it in January then. Maybe in June. Um, let's, let's check back in June. Uh, June of next year, of course, for the release. Check back in June of this year. No, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to manage staff, call clean. Great, get a cleaner in here. Clean up that disgusting floor. Thank you. Are all of our programmers terrible at, uh, at uh, audio code or something? Sean's really good at it. Amber's not so great at it. Ben's not bad at it. Hmm. Go ahead and send her for a month of education on that. You know what? Let's even go ahead and send Ben for a month as well. 
The rest of these guys I'm going to leave. Because they're still working on those bugs. They're making good progress. There we go. We've got about two-thirds of them fixed at this point. A little more than two-thirds, it looks like. That was a lot noisier than I expected it to be. I don't know how noisy it was for you guys, but I looked over at the the uh, little audio indicator and it looked like it was really noisy, so I apologize. Are you, I really need to be better about uh, taking care of these ambient noises and I like my little coughs and stuff. Um, I think I can probably stop marketing flat draw. That's not what I wanted. Oh, come on. It's got to be a shortcut key for closing these windows. Um, I still sold $127,000 worth last month. So, like, the marketing is paying off. I'm not sure how much we're spending on it, but it seems like we're, I, I'm almost certain we're not spending $80,000 on it. Looks like we're going to end up spending about $15,000 on it. So, yeah, you know, we'll keep marketing it. Bugs are making their way towards being completely eliminated. 70 to go. A couple, couple of months and we'll be in good shape. Hmm, did not sell any last month, did we? $53,000. All right, well, we're still making a profit. All right, we'll get another review on listener. Uh-huh. That won't bother me so much once somebody gets in there and we can turn on the AC. How hot is it in here? Oh, it was pretty hot. Hallway it gets warm. People are not spending enough time in there to cool it down. An employee is hot. Um, probably the one that was in the hallway. Now it's time to go home anyways. Alright. Uh, we are on listener. We're going to go review outsource. Spend a few thousand dollars on that. It's not looking that much better. Hmm. Well product has taken a lot longer than I expected. I would say we will announce a release date of November 85. Yeah, I think we can I think we can hit that. So, it's going to mean a lot of uh, a lot more programming. Oh, that's right. That's because I had everybody in a class that month, huh? Well, shoot. I don't really know, like, if you release before the release date, is that a bad thing? Seems like it would have to be at least somewhat of a bad thing, otherwise what's the point of having a release date? Um, hmm, yeah, I don't know. Another thing, it would be nice to know what the release date stuff has to do. I have released before a release date before, and my sales were terrible. But, you know, I don't know if that was just because the, the uh, marketing was bad. I guess that would be part of bad marketing, wouldn't it? That's not like we have to release it. We can, if we have it finished, we can uh, we can work on something else. Bugs are looking good. Oh, looking real good, actually. Let's start training up some of these. Um, training up some of these B team. Uh, we'll do a couple people at a time. Um, Let's see, uh, educate programmer, two months. Why don't you go into 3D? And you, why don't you do audio? There we go. So it'll take a few years to really get these guys ready for prime time, but you know, it'll be really nice when we have a, a strong team of like eight people that can, can handle a big project. And, uh, you know, we'll be, you know, a, a project that'll make us like five or eight million dollars or something. Um, that'll be pretty sweet, so. Alright, uh, I don't think you're going to need to keep marketing flat draw there. Um, uh, let's see what the sales are looking like for flat draw. Uh, we still sold 30000 last month. We only spent 15000 this month. So, I mean, even even though the sales aren't great, we are making a profit off of our marketing. I don't know what the sales would be without the marketing, but it seems like they probably wouldn't be as high. Oh, 
Well, I guess we're going to have to wait until next month or whatever to find out because that is it for this month. I'm going to call in a cleaning. Um, do we need like maintenance? 80%, 60%. Yep, let's call maintenance and uh, IT. Oh yeah, for sure. Let's call IT as well. Uh, Alright guys, uh, I hope you uh, have enjoyed watching this episode. Uh, if you have, maybe click the like button or leave a comment. I always like hearing from you. If you want me to put your name in here, let me know. There was somebody... Uh, oh yeah, that's right. It's insert name. Let's get uh, let's get insert name's name in here. Um, if you would like me to uh, put in a, uh, uh, a different name for you, insert name, uh, just let me know. You know, I don't know whether you are a man or a woman, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, give you the uh, Amber here, who's been um, with us for a while. Um, obviously, if you're not so concerned about what your name says on YouTube, you probably don't care how you're identified gender-wise. So, uh, And also the insert name, or well, it is insert name now. Um, but uh, whatever that uh, programmer was, looks pretty androgynous anyways. Not, uh, not exactly a masculine or feminine uh, uh, thing there. Um, Alright guys, it seems like that was a good episode. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. I definitely had a good time and uh, well, I, I'm really liking this game. And uh, I want to just keep on playing. But, uh, you know, I will wait until you guys come back and we'll watch the next episode tomorrow. I'll see you then. Bye.